Hey guys, so I'm going to do a quick uh, video of the clothing and jewelry I got today. Um, if you hear stuff in the background, my brothers are watching Phineas and Ferb, so that's what you're hearing. Um, and also my voice sounds like I'm sick. I'm not. It's real bad allergies. Uh, I'm in Tennessee right now, so the cold front is coming in at the same time as it's been warm, so my allergies are just awful. So I promise I'm not sick. I just sound really bad. So anyway, um, for various reasons, I went to Goodwill today, which is, Friday is not a day I normally go. I usually go on a Sunday, sometimes a Wednesday, but that's about it. But uh, I needed, I head back to school on Sunday, and so I needed to get a few things for work and classes and that kind of thing. So I'll show you what I got. Plus, you know, a girl can never have too many clothes. So uh, it was green tags. Everything with green tags was was half off so everything I bought was half off so I got this white blouse it's a blouse I'm gonna wear it as a tunic it's a good basic it's got a collar which is a requirement for work but you know a, a, a white blouse is uh, something every girl should have in their closet I this will make my like my third blouse I think but they're all different styles all different sleeve lengths and that kind of thing then I got this because I love tunics I'm obsessed with India and so I do a lot of my outfits are shirts and tunics and things that I do an American twist on an Indian clothing just because I don't have enough um, Indian tunics called kameezes to wear um, every day plus a lot of them are fancy so um, this is one this blouse was actually made in India so I just about had a heart attack I'm like give me that obviously I won't be wearing it by itself I will be wearing something underneath it. Pairing this with a brown skirt and my brown beaded heels though, fabulous. Be great for going to an interview or doing classroom observations um, as an education major. It's good to have some like observation outfits because we do observe in the classroom quite a bit. Um, then this was all, this was made in Vietnam. I thought this was India. Vietnam. This is a very soft knit material so it's not gonna wrinkle because it's knit but it looks like it's a very nice blouse material. It's very soft, gorgeous color. I have a great belt I'm gonna wear with it. I don't know what I do with it. I'll see if I can find it. But um, So yeah I was very happy with that. Again a collar perfect for work. Put a black cami or a white cami sleeve the long sleeve shirt underneath, black skirt, nice shoes, bam, you got a great outfit. Uh, this out, this shirt was made in India. Love the color of this. Love the, this one is tailored, it's a tailored shirt, and it's got a it kind of flares out there at the bottom. Pairing this with a lot of different things. You pair it with black. You pair it with brown. You pair it with off white, white, all kinds of stuff. It's a great basic color. You could also wear it just as a jacket. If you have uh, a patterned blouse that has this color in it, you could easily wear it as a jacket. And it will complete any outfit. So here's the belt I found. Love it. It's a gold braid. Great belt. Love it. This was the only full price thing I paid for. It was only $2 full price. Everything else I got half off. Um, next, I was thrilled to find this. I've been looking for a black denim jean black denim skirt for years. I'm not kidding, years. Probably been about four years. Finally found one. A lot of them, a lot of the denim, black denim skirts are mini skirts. Um, um, that's, that's not going to work for me. So this is a long, it's actually very heavy denim. And so I'm, I'm thrilled. I finally got one of those so that when I don't need black dress skirt, I can still make something look really nice about, about dressing it down by wearing the denim. Then I found just a regular blue denim which is good because one of my regular denim skirts bit the dust uh, right before break because I've worn it so much. Um, denim skirts are kind of a go-to for me because I go with everything. So when I need to, you know, dress for work or just want to look fairly pulled together, I go for a denim shirt, a denim skirt, and then a collared shirt, and it it's fairly nice. So those were all good. Well, and you compare uh, again the black denim skirt and the blue jean skirt. Um, a, a, and a white blouse. Those are all really good basics because you can do so much with them. And then again, getting solid colored button down blouses, even if they're not designed to be coats, if they're tailored, you can wear them as like a, a jacket and create a whole nother outfit. And then if you wanted to, you could just 
button it down and you got a completely different look. So I got those at Goodwill. Then I went to Kano to look for this watch that I wanted, which they had sold, sadly. Drat. But it was before Christmas, so I figured that it was gorgeous. But I, of course, knowing me, I checked the clearance rack. This is a solid black knit skirt. No slits. It's super long. I was thrilled. It was on clearance for $8, my size. I was thrilled because a girl can never have too many black skirts. Um, especially when you're like me and you're out growing skirts. For I, At school, I have to have solid black for when I play concerts um, or when I do catering through work. We have to have solid black. So I, have, I now have three or four solid black skirts, which I'm thrilled. Uh, knit is fabulous because it doesn't wrinkle and it's just, it's great. So then, also checking the clearance jewelry because I'm a sucker for jewelry and again, I'm obsessed with India, so if it's made in India, if it looks like it's made in India, if it has anything that looks slightly Indian, if it's purple, um, I'm going to want it. So I want, and sure, now if you notice, I don't have pierced ears, and I don't plan on piercing my ears just because um, I don't see a need for it, but also I'm, I have a tendency to be allergic to a lot of things, a lot of different kinds of like lotions and things, so I, I don't want to see if I'm allergic to metal. So far, my this, this this is from Israel. This is sterling silver. It hasn't bothered me. I haven't had any issues, but I also haven't, you know, worn a lot of cheap jewelry. So I don't know. Anyway, I went to the clearance section. This was a dollar. These are dangle. These are clip-on. They look orange. They're actually kind of a peachy color. Thrilled. I'm using the word thrilled a lot today. Don't know why. Then I also got the same kind of a design, but these are like a, uh, well, they change color. They were mint green in the store. They're clear now. So I guess it just depends on the light, but that's fine. Light green and white, they go together. Clear, it's fine. And then those were also a dollar. And then these were a dollar. So for $8, let's see, $8 skirt at Kato and three sets of $1 earrings. I was pretty thrilled. I was pretty thrilled. Pretty thrilled, pretty thrilled. A lot of thrilled. I don't know what's up with that. And then I spent less than $20 at Goodwill for all the pieces that you saw. So I was pretty pleased overall with my finds. And let me know what you guys find. This is a great time to shop because Christmas is over. So stores are clearing their Christmas, like in the case of Cato, they're, they're clearing their winter stuff and their Christmas stuff. And everyone went all out for Christmas so they don't have kind of broke now. So this is a great time to go in and take advantage of sales and clearances and coupons and all of that. It's a great time to do that. The whole month of January is fabulous. Goodwill is not the case with that because they're just like that year round. They don't really like have a Christmas special kind of a thing. So their prices are pretty, pretty steady. Again, I recommend Sunday or Wednesday as the best time to shop. But as you see today, I went in and I didn't buy anything but the belt because the belt was only $2. I didn't buy anything else that wasn't on sale, so everything was like two fifty ish. Um, I think the skirts may have been three, but the shirts were like two fifty. So anyway, there you have it. That's what I did. That's what I got today. Um, I will probably try to find a couple more things. I do leave on Sunday, so um, I do need to get like socks, which you don't need to see, but if I can find like a black sweater and that kind of a thing. I'd like to, but. That's what I got. I'll talk to you later. Bye.